Virgo, let's get started on a read. Uh, the Six of Pentacles is here. So I feel like this could be some type of exchange or I feel like you could be exchanging uh, with the Pisces or I feel like you could be exchanging with a delayed person. So you could be wondering like what's going on spiritually or you could be uh, wondering what type of exchange is taking place. You could be dealing with someone who's slow or there could be a delay uh, in a particular area. Let's see, Virgo. Sun, moon, rising, Venus in the North Node. So the Knight of Pentacles, I feel like slow moving energy, can't make it up. You have the Ace of Cups with the Nine of Cups. Slow moving energy or slow moving motherfuckers. I feel like um, something about genuine feeling as well when it comes to a form of creativity or I feel like uh, you're comfortable with some type of creativity or some type of motive that you could have or go. I feel like whatever your motive is, it could be fulfilling uh, with the Nine of Cups. Let's see more for Virgo. So you have the death card. So some type of fake energy or I feel like some type of transformation when it comes to Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio energy or Virgo, Taurus or Capricorn. I also get Gemini, Libra, Aquarius here or a need for you to get more information uh, when it comes to an ending or when it comes to the death of a situation. What is the death card for Virgo? What is the death card for Virgo? So you have the justice card. So something about a viral energy in a Libra or some type of investment surrounding a Libra. I also get gossip and communication surrounding Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio or I feel like a very creative energy, Virgo, when it comes to the truth. I feel like you're putting the truth uh, out there in some type of way. I feel like you're telling the truth or I feel like there could be options, uh, Virgo, when it comes to a form of work or a pentacle or some money. Um, I see you making the investment or a need for you to make the investment. I feel like now is the time. I also get um, something about germs or something about not having enough. Or I feel like something about the truth is someone doesn't have enough. I feel like they don't have enough. This is the problem. Um, I also get something about germs. So I feel like uh, something is gross. Something is like ill. It's like cooties or, ger or germs. Or I feel like uh, someone could be going viral even with the Seven of Pentacles, Justice, and the Death card. Someone went viral. I feel like it was fake. It wasn't real. Or I feel like someone went viral and it was the absolute truth. Let's see. So you could be dealing with Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, or I feel like emotional redemption uh, when it comes to a group or third party energy. I even get uh, someone could be showing you some type of emotional love or there's some type of emotional or uh, some type of lovey-dovey energy of <laughs> Virgo with the Knight of Wands. There could be some recklessness surrounding Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio or the emotions of someone. I feel like this could be unexpected with the Knight of Wands energy. Let's see. So the Knight of Wands can also speak of um, Virgo protecting yourself from deception. While with the Seven of Swords, I feel like you're protecting yourself from someone's discontentment. I feel like someone's discontent and a need for you to protect yourself, uh, whichever way that may be. What is the Seven of Swords in the Knight of Wands? So you have the two of wands. So moving in a new direction is what I see, Virgo, for you. With the page of cups, I feel like this could be your divine comfort or a divine gesture or something being offered to you uh, here, Virgo. Could be a love offer for many of you guys. I see a love offer coming in or I feel like someone would like to offer you a cup of love, a gesture or some shit. I feel like um, love offer coming in. Let's see, what is the page of cups? Judgment card. So... For many of you, I see something about a call or that's your judgment. Your judgment is to be in a relationship. Your judgment is to be the Empress. I feel like this is you, Empress, Queen of Swords. I feel like you're implementing something here or judgment surrounding some type of offer. Empress, you could be dealing with Libra, Taurus. You could be dealing with uh, heavy Libra energy here. Or I feel like there could be something being implemented when it comes to relationship or you seeing eye to eye with someone. I feel like if you see eye to eye with someone here, Virgo, sparks could fly. That's what I'm picking up with the Three of Swords. Sparks could uh, most certainly fly with the Three of Swords. Queen of Swords, Two of Cups. I feel like this is the truth or there could be communication surrounding this with the Five of Swords energy. Virgo, I feel like 
in other words, someone that had the right one. Could be dealing with the Taurus. I feel like a Taurus energy could be losing their head or a Taurus energy could be um, very, very hateful surrounding some type of communication. I also get uh, something about a brand new passionate beginning here. Something about a brand new passionate beginning. I feel like this could be the what or this could be like the main focus in a situation your brand new passionate beginning or i feel like this could be a contest it's giving me like contest vibes or there could be something about bobbing for apples <laughs> Virgo is what i'm seeing i feel like there could be a taurus very upset with some type of communication or i feel like this could be um someone that you're close-knit with or there's a connection surrounding watching energy I feel like if someone didn't watch you so much, they could focus on what they need to focus on with the Six of Cups followed by the Queen of Pentacles. This could be someone you're contractually obligated to uh, face or see or deal with. I even get a uh, separation when it comes to this person. With the Chariot card and the Seven of Cups, I feel like someone could be watching obsessively or excessively, or I feel like there could be hold up when it comes to a person watching you or... I feel like for many of you guys, you could be dealing with a stalker or some type of destruction when it comes to contract or the perseverance of a situation. I even get there could be some confusion surrounding Cancerian energy or a Cancer is watching and saving face. I feel like a Cancer knows exactly what you're saying and what you're um, communicating, Virgo, or whatever you said to them. The Devil card, there could be restrictions surrounding someone's perseverance as well. Or I feel like a need for you to... Uh, Focus on your independence, Virgo. There could be a lot going on or a lot that's quite challenging when it comes to an Aquarius or the influence of something. I feel like someone, all they like to do is <laughs> get high or <laughs> all someone likes to do is drink or I feel like all someone likes to do is party. So I feel like you could be making a significant connection, Virgo, to crossing something or someone um, out maybe in your life with the five of pentacles energy followed by the uh, five of wands in the star card so there could be conflict surrounding aquarius energy or i feel like someone's a total disgrace in the spirit with the devil card what is this you have the four of pentacles so withholding a situation or i feel like uh, possessions of a situation here so you have the Ten of Swords and the Hermit. So revelation when it comes to you, Virgo, or I feel like something could be very hard to maneuver surrounding conspiracy. So this could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, or I feel like something's quite laughable. What is the Five of Pentacles? What is the Five of Pentacles for Virgo? The Eight of Pentacles. So some type of conversation or something that someone's saying. Uh, something about all right. Something about the word, all right, Virgo. I feel like that could be something that you're saying to someone. Uh, all right. What is this? <laughs> yeah, the Ten of Cups. So something that's quite laughable. With the Two of Pentacles energy, I feel like some decisions may have to be made uh, going forward. Or something about the next 10 months. I even get uh, something that's quite manageable, Virgo, uh, surrounding karma. Could be uh, something surrounding Capricorn energy. I feel like it's quite manageable. Virgo, this is what I'm getting. I'm going to leave it here. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe.